Now we want to take a couple seconds and talk about something that none of us can see and unfortunately every now and then we overlook and that is airflow. Airflow is tremendously important to your engine because not only does it keep your engine cool but it's also responsible for making your AC system cool at maximum efficiency. And I can tell you this, if you're rolling around South Florida on a hot July day, you want that AC working as efficiently as possible. Well, newer vehicles use an electroviscous fan clutch like the one we've got here from Hayden Automotive. The electroviscous fan clutch is used to maintain engine and HVAC cooling requirements while saving fuel by reducing fan speed more quickly than a traditional viscous fan clutch. This truck's PCM looks at various inputs like engine coolant temp, trans temp, AC request, and vehicle speed to determine how fast that fan should be turning. This particular fan right here is for a 5.9 Cummins. So what happens with these diesel engines, they're already made with a heavy duty cooling system, but they don't make a lot of heat until they're under sufficient load. So potentially you or the guy working on your truck, you may not even know that there's a problem with the fan. Now a common problem is the wires can get chewed up and that'll obviously lead to an open circuit. When that happens, the PCM can't read it and it puts up an error code. Well, I guess that makes good sense when you have a component that's controlled by some wires and the wires get messed up, it doesn't work anymore, right? So that's why you want to be extra careful when you're replacing this. So you take the blade assembly, do a quick visual inspection on that, make sure it's all good, check your mounting brackets, make sure they're where they need to be, and like you said, keep the wire out of the way. Well, hopefully this gives you a better understanding of how an electroviscous fan works and why it's so important to maybe upgrade or replace yours with one from Hayden Automotive, which you can get at Federated Auto Parts.